Genetics and medicine, they both go hand in hand. Especially when it comes to obstetrics and gynecology, we have a lot to do with genetics. When a regular patient of obstetrics that is pregnancy comes to us, we routinely do a, a genetic analysis test in the form of quadruple marker test or a pentamarker test. And if this test comes something abnormal, then we send the patient for analysis of the amniocentesis or sometimes CVS to rule out any abnormalities in the baby, especially Down syndrome. Why is it important? So that after seeing that, we can have a genetic counseling with the family and let them decide about uh, the present pregnancy and the need for it for the next pregnancies also. Similarly, when a woman comes to us with recurrent pregnancy losses or abortions and they all can be evaluated and sometimes when there is a recurrent neonatal deaths or infertility also, genetic analysis is done both for the woman and the husband and then the analysis is uh, discussed with the patient with the counsellor and then the outcomes can be predicted and accordingly managed. So this is something which we do in day in day out life in our practice. So genetics has a long way to go and much more many more things to be done in our profession.